Jersey Sports Zone's Camp Countdown coverage is being brought to you by RWJ Barnabas Health. Wall was rocked by a hazing scandal that saw the Crimson Knights forfeit its final two games of the 2021 season. The Crimson Knights turned to one of the shore's most respected football coaches to help restore a program that was rocked. Former Manalapan headman Ed Guerreri is back on the sidelines and had a strong first impression from his new team. We were in the weight room from the day I got there. Uh, nobody missed. Everybody was there. Everybody was on time. Everybody wanted to work. They wanted to be coached. And um, it's, been a, it's been good from the beginning. It, it, if you close your eyes, I thought I was in Manalapan's weight room. So uh, everything so far has been on point. Guerreri won 109 games in his 13 years at Manalapan, reaching five straight sectional finals and winning a title. The Crimson Knights players have quickly bonded with their new leader. He's everything we could have asked for in a new coach. He's just the best thing that's ever happened to us. He's awesome. I like his dynamic. And his, the way he rallies us is just all new, and it's great. Especially now, after all that we went through, everybody's still so close, and we're still so bonded tightly together. It's just uh, it gives us even more hope and more strength, especially with someone like Coach Gray. You know, fantastic coach, great reputation, uh, coming in to coach us and help us out. It's just a really great feeling getting back to what we do. Wall will spend August finding new talent to fill in at key skill position spots. The strength of the Crimson Knights is up front on both sides of the line. That unit will be paramount to Wall being able to build confidence playing in the top tier American division of the Shore Conference. Oh, we just take tremendous pride in what we do, doing everything the right way and going 100% all, all the time. Wall's product on the field has been stellar over the past three years. Guerreri already sees that the healing has begun for a team that truly has a clean slate in 2022. This is a great program. There's a bunch of really good football players here. Um, so unfortunately, you know, some things happened in the past. Uh, the past is the past. We're looking forward and um, we're going to do everything the right way. And uh, I can't wait for this year to start. They, the kids work hard. They get after it. They love football. And that's all you can ask for. Reporting for Jersey Sports Zone. I'm Rich Crampanis.